A solar power project is designed to save energy, to help save energy while educating others. And Emily Deem is live in Green Bay to show it to us. Hi, Em. Good morning, Rachel. Hi, everyone. Yeah, this project is to benefit the Sisters of St. Francis of the Holy Cross. And you can take a look at this huge project that's actually in their backyard, this solar power project. Crews are working hard this morning. Even though it's raining, rain or shine, they're getting it done. I want to introduce you to Jesse Mikulski with Eland Electric, project manager. This is a really cool project, and we can see that some of the panels are up, but that's just a portion of what they're doing to finish this. Yeah, the, the installing the panels is, is the nice visible part. It, it what it's what makes it look like the project is is in progress mode. Um, we still have to wire every individual panel together. Uh, we initially had to install all the anchors and all the racking. Once we get all the modules wired together, we have to run the wires back to the convent for the sisters and then interconnect it with their existing electrical system. Yeah, I know if you can see, you can't really see it, but off in the distance, the convent is over there. But it's actually underground, a lot of stuff that people won't see. So if you pan over there, you can see that dirt that's built up. Tell me about those wires over there. Yeah, um, we, we also with the anchors, we wanted to use uh, um, earth anchors. So we're not digging up the ground. We're not pouring concrete foundations. Um, so we really wanted to mi minimize soil disturbance. So to get the wires back to the convent, um, we use a directional boring method to, to get pipes underground back to the convent. And the conduits and the wires will carry all this renewable energy from the field uh, array location here back to the convent. And if people want to learn more about solar energy, you have a workshop coming up in May. Yeah, we have uh, more of an informal meet and greet uh, May 1st uh, from 4 to 7 up at Barkhausen Waterfall Preserve in Swamico. And we'll be sure to get that on our website. So right now we want to introduce you to Sister Rose Yachman. She is over here with her umbrella because it's raining, but they have to get this project done. Uh, we want to tell people at home the benefits. How is this benefiting the sisters? All right. Uh, the benefit, the major benefit will be 30% of our electrical power will come from the solar instead of coal generated electricity. So that's a wonderful benefit. In 10 years, we hope that the investment that we put into the project will have been returned through the savings. But most of all, the benefit is that we want to witness to others the care for our earth and sustainability. And that really, you know, what we've been saying, that's your mission that is here mission. and all over. That's correct. That is our mission to uh, take care for the earth for the future generations and also educate others about our mission to save the resources of our earth. Sister, thank you for letting us share your story with our viewers. Rachel Pete, we'll send it back to you.